Alta tonight, you can see a pretty good south wind blowing. That's why it's so humid here. And we have rain, heavier rain though from the capital region southward. Everybody's getting a good dose of rainfall. No reports of any severe weather. Biggest thunderstorm, as we'll show you, is up in Berkshire County. Here are the temps right now. These are rain cooled. We were in the low to mid 80s today. Now we've dropped into the uh, 70s. Look at uh, Cobleskill. They've been hit by one storm after another that's dropped the temperature down to 63. It is very humid out there. That's the fuel uh, for these storms. 82 in Whitehall, Queensbury 73, Hebron at 78. Up in the Adirondacks, Hamilton County, Jane Williamson at Indian Lake 75, Long Lake uh, 73. Humid, showers and thunderstorms from Caroga Lake to Dwaynesburg, 77 in Greenfield Center. Grafton 70, Hoosick Falls 78, 67 in Lanesboro, over six inches of rain at Bill Mahone's house uh, for the month of June. So he goes, the dry spell's over. He's had enough rain out there in Lanesboro. Out to the west, Summit, been hit by thunderstorms today, 67. There's been some heavy rain from Germantown over to Hillsdale, upper 60s to near 70. Let's focus in on the radar. Heavy rain now from Saratoga Springs South, all lifting northward. We have some flood advisories in effect for Ulster and Dutchess counties. Look at this thunderstorm in Columbia County uh, from uh, Green River to Austerlitz, Canaan, up to uh, New Lebanon moving north. A lot of cloud to ground lightning around Valencia. Big downpour in East Greenbush as well. In Green County from Carroll Junction northward, to Greenville. Again, a lot of lightning here. Heavy rain lifting up towards the Alcove Reservoir and big cluster of lightning downpours. And based on radar, we thought maybe a little bit of small hail. Now crossing into a Wyndham County in Vermont out of the uh, northern Berkshire. So the bottom line is everybody's getting something tonight. Some places getting a lot of rain. Steamy weather. This storm takes two more days to get by us. So a repeat performance tomorrow and probably Wednesday as well. We're a little bit more optimistic for the end of the week. Thursday, Friday, some of this dry air is going to work its way eastward. Future casts again tonight, showers, thunderstorms, waning and weakening as we get into the early morning hours and shifting east. Tomorrow we do it again, another round, especially midday through the early evening. And then on Wednesday, that storm slowly shifting east. Still more showers and uh, some scattered thunderstorms. Again, Friday is the better day, hopefully based on the info today. 82 tomorrow in Albany, 81. Glens Falls to Johnstown, high humidity, 79 at Pittsfield. And on Wednesday, temperatures in the mid to upper 70s. Another day with showers and some thunder. Let's recap the uh, forecast. Tonight, a muggy, buggy night for us, no doubt about it. Uh, showers, some thunderstorms, many downpours, especially the first half of tonight, a low of 68. Mostly cloudy for primary day tomorrow, still humid. Scattered showers and thunderstorms, most numerous afternoon and evening. Wednesday, mostly cloudy showers, chance of a thunderstorm, 78. A little bit better on Thursday, some sunshine. Uh, 81. Look at Friday. Partly sunny, 86. Weekend, holiday weekend begins for a lot of you. A few showers and thunderstorms over the weekend. Humid, mid 80s. And Monday, partly sunny, chance of a shower and a high of 85. Back to you guys.